25% of American women in their lifetimes will experience physical or sexual or other violence from their intimate partner. About 10% of men in their lifetime will experience intimate partner violence. When women are murdered, they're murdered most often by a husband, boyfriend, ex-husband, or ex-boyfriend. If it's 97%, 98%, 99% of rape is done by men. So why is it a women's issue? Men are the ones doing it. In my experience, most of the time, there have been 20 or more cases of domestic violence where the police were not contacted. People who add strangulation and put, who put hands around someone's neck are killers. In a culture that completely sexualizes men, literally putting their hands around a woman's throat and she's practically about to pass out and that's somehow sexy and a sexual charge for men to think that somehow that's not connected to the increase in strangulations that men are engaging in in controlling and abusing women it's to me it's naive to think that there's no connection a lot of them are smart they will hit you and bruise you in places that no one can really see at first 50% of people will have no visible marks on their neck. Only 35% of those people will have marks you're able to get photographs from. Why doesn't she just leave? Why didn't she leave? You know, why didn't she leave when it first started? Why doesn't she leave? Why didn't I leave? Why did you stay there and let somebody abuse you? Why didn't she just leave is still a prominent question in the cultural discussion. But we don't ever get to the root of the causes. Why did that abuser abuse to start with? Calling it a women's issue is a subtle form of victim blaming. The Violence Against Women Act is up for renewal. The Violence Against Women Act provides uh, a lot of grant funds uh, to educate law enforcement and, and to put programs into place as far as for prosecution and victims witness advocacy. And it has not yet been renewed, unfortunately. We as a society have to focus more on um, how communities can respond. As a society and as a culture, if we don't help them through that, we're gonna continue to have this problem. We're gonna continue to have victims.